Yo, what's up world? It's your boy Falochko here and today we are going to have a lesson on understanding important signs in New York City. A lot of these signs are really related to rules, things you should or should not do. And if you do some of these things that you're not supposed to do, you will owe the city a lot of money from $200 to $500 depending on the rule that you have broken. So the reason I really want to make this episode is because I was in Moscow. And when I was in Moscow, I saw two signs. Two signs that were telling me what to do and what not to do, but I didn't understand it, and look at what I thought. Were you American? Let me see if you're something about the Russian metro station. See here? This means like 1 o'clock in the morning. You can go. And of course, white people are allowed. But you know, this is a different country. It's not America. No, it's not that much of a right. Here is plain and simple. No <laughs> black people allowed in the Russian metro station. So I'm breaking the rules. No, but we learned a lot. Don't come here for black later. You see, I thought one sign meant only white people allowed and the other sign was no black people allowed because there was a white guy on this side and then there was a black guy on this side but he had a cross on him. So I thought I wasn't allowed in the train station. So, and because of that, I don't want you to make the same mistake. So today, we are going to focus on three different rules here in New York City. So, let's get to the first one. Please hold handrail. The handrail. She is holding the handrail. I'm just following some girl and filming her. She is holding the handrail. Please hold on to the handrail. And what is the handrail? The handrail is basically that pole in which you hold when you're walking down the stairs or it's the rubber in which you can hold when you're on an escalator. And that is what it is and that is how you do it. Now it's not a rule. If you don't hold on to the handrail, you will be okay. You're not going to be in trouble. But if you hurt yourself, that is bad for the train company. But basically, this is just me letting you know what the handrail is and why they want you to hold on to it. It's for your safety, but not only your safety, it's so they can keep their money. So, let's get to the next thing. And the next sign is... No loitering. No loitering. And what is no loitering? Well, that is staying in one spot with no apparent purpose. Just sitting there, not really doing anything of importance. Just wasting time in one spot, usually with your friends doing nothing. So basically, you have to keep it moving. In a lot of places here in America, there's a lot of spots you will see a lot of people just standing around, not doing anything, maybe drinking something or eating some sunflower seeds. I'm sure you have people who do this in Russia too. Like in Russia, a lot of Gopnik loiter, they sit like this and they eat the sunflower seeds and drink beer a lot. That's how they loiter. That's their form of loitering. So, let's get to the next and last sign for today. No standing. Now, in this case, was I breaking the rule because I was standing next to that sign? Was I breaking the rules? No, because in this case, no standing actually means no stopping of the vehicle for certain reasons. Now the rules for this are very difficult, but I tell you this, if you see a no standing sign, you cannot stop your car there to wait for someone or talk on your cell phone or waste time. You can only stay there to let people out of your car or to have someone come into your car, but you cannot park your car there because you will owe like $115 and that's a lot of rubles, so don't do it. But hey, if you want to be cool, you want to stand there eating sunflower seeds like a gopnik, sure, you can do it, and no one's going to get you in trouble, as long as you are not doing it from a car. And you'll be safe. And so that's the end of the episode for today. I hope you liked it, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you learned new stuff. Be sure to add me, vk.com slash that's me, and subscribe to my YouTube page to see all my videos. As you see this video, I believe it's my birthday, so I'm going to take a day off, and I'll see you guys after my birthday, and I'll make more videos after that. So. See you later, and I'll be a 